Hi neighbors, watch me film my video. Hey guys, so it is June. Can you believe it that it's already June? And for most of you, that means you're getting out of school soon. Whoa! You excited? I'm excited for you. Anyway, like I said in the April favorites that I really have been enjoying some really good things in May. So let's get started. Da, da, da. We'll start with jewelry, accessories. That's the word I was looking for, accessories. Okay, so the first one up is, I've had these for over a year now and I still wear them like crazy. And they are my Mark by Marc Jacobs sunglasses and I just love them. They're just so summery. They give me a summer vibe just because it has these really cute tritones and since they are not in season anymore, yay for not really following seasons. So since they're not in season, I wouldn't say they're at the full price that they were last time. So if you want to check out where I got these, they come in different colors like green and blue, different tri-color shades. I will put it in my blog post and link the blog post down below like I always do. I'm so fashion. Okay, so my next thing I'm very excited about. I recently became part of the My Flash Trash Charm Gang on Instagram and I couldn't wait until I like got a discount code or anything like that. I went straight away <laughs> shopping and all I did was get the flash bracelet. I didn't get any charms yet. I'm waiting to see what I like. I don't know. So this is what the case it comes in. It comes with a cute sticker for you. This is the case it comes in and you open it and look how cute. And this is the bracelet. And then you're meant to add charms onto it once you, you know, get charms. If you're not following me on Instagram, you should because I give out discount codes when I get them from them. So that's pretty awesome and it's really cute stuff. Okay, so the next is beauty. Yeah, beauty. And of course, something from my Ipsy bag. This is a Pixie by Petra, Petra? Bronzer. So if you're like me and you just kind of work and stay in during the summer, bronzer kind of gives you that glow that people will really think that you're outside like catching the rays, but it's a healthy way of doing it. Wear sunscreen, kids. Wear sunscreen. This next one I feel like has been in my favorites, but I absolutely have no idea if I've ever put in my favorites. And it is um, Not Your Mother's Beach Babe Texturizing Sea Salt Spray. Kinda have it in my hair right now, kinda, sorta. Um, and since it's the summer, we're going for that bronze beach goddess look. This is the way to do it, and it's so, it smells good. Like every time I wear it, people compliment me on my hair and that it smells really good. If you have a better one or no better products, let me know down below. So this next one is actually a lip stain and it is from CoverGirl and it is Outlast. It's the lip stain in JK, I don't know what color. It's in 435. I don't know if that makes any sense to you, but if you go to CoverGirl and the Outlast and look for 435, this is the color you will receive. And I love it because I lipstick, sometimes I can't do it. I'm on a run, I'm going to work, and I still kind of want to look like I'm slightly put together, so I usually do my eyebrows and throw on some bronzer and then put this on and then I run out. Like I don't even do like BB cream or anything. That's like the fastest way to look like I'm somewhat put together. So a lip stain's awesome and it lasts throughout like the whole day, which is something that lip gloss can't always do, lipstick can't always do, especially when you're eating. I always eat. Feed your body. Look at these health tips I'm giving you everyone. Health tips and it's a little marker. You can't really mess up. It's a marker. These next things are a bit miscellaneous and I feel like this kind of has been said since I make videos about this, but it's The Craft by Lou Teasdale. It has been out for quite some time. I've had it for a while, but since it's the summer and people are getting out of school, you can kind of experiment with your look a little bit more. I know a lot of people go to schools where you have to wear a uniform or your hair has to be a certain way, and now this is your chance to really take these looks and make them your own. Uh, I will link some of the videos that I do with the craft and how I make them my style down below. So if you wanted to watch those, watch those if you haven't. And if you haven't picked up Lou Teasdale's book, like, do it. Just do it. You won't regret it. 
Cantaloupe! Woo! This is actually a favorite of mine. I have just been eating fruit like a crazy person this past month. I'm trying to be healthier, which you will see in the next few items of my favorites. And just eating fruit has been great. I know that this has a lot of sugar, as does bananas and stuff, but it's better than eating like, you know, refined sugar and all that stuff. So if you're lucky enough to have fresh fruit in your area, because it is the summer, there are different fruits and you should go and eat them. Okay, so these last two items are actually apps. This first app is Zombies Run. Do you remember when zombies were a thing? Because they were and uh, this app kind of came out of it and I think it's quite old, but I've been really starting to get my cardio back up and starting to go run and so basically it looks like this. What happens with the app is that it tracks where you've run and you listen through headphones, obviously, um, and they tell you a story and they say, okay, in like 500 meters, you're picking up water or you have to go run to a hospital and you can run straight. Like it's like, the, you don't actually have to like turn or like whatever, but it's really cool. And it's coming from like a mission control center and you're a runner and you're trying to save people and it's very stressful. Um, and on top of that, there's zombies that are attacking you, so you can hear them in your headphones and they get closer and closer and it goes like, warning, zombies approaching and something, something, and you're like, oh my god, I have to run faster, or I have to walk faster, or I have to jog faster. And it really helps you, like, kind of do, like, in like interval training with it, but not really. Warning, though, it does cost, like, money, I don't know, but it was worth it. I don't remember how much it was. I literally bought it freshman year of college and that's like, what, four years ago? So it's an old app, but it's a good app. And if you're trying to get your cardio up, it's a fun one. You can put how long you want to run for and that's how long your mission will be. And then when your mission's over, they have these hilarious like talk show hosts that play your music and then like talk to you while you're running. It, I don't know, it's so fun. And if you've ever used the app or use another running app that helps motivate you, let me know down below. And my last app. I'm very obsessed with it. It is the Vlogilates app. And if you're not subscribed to Vlogilates or Cassie Ho, um, what are you doing? It's amazing. I do it every single day. It's like an hour of Pilates. Fridays are your skip relax days where you do stretching and stuff, but it comes with a calendar, which is 99 cents a month. And must I must say, it is so worth it. Now I do have a gym membership, but I can't always make it to the gym. And I do this, I wake up early, and I do a quick hour of Pilates, and I feel stronger, I feel my body changing, and it's so nice. She has recipes, um, forums, I follow people. So if you wanna check it out, it's connected to my Twitter, so it's Maeve Slade. On the workout calendar, when you've done the workout, you get to, you get to, check it off and you feel like you've done something amazing with your day, which you have if you have done Pilates for an hour. It's amazing. If you're not part of the Blogilates Fit Fam, then you really should become one if you're looking to like get fit this summer. And I feel like I just ranted so long about Blogilates that I feel like you're probably really tired of it. I actually lied. I have one more thing and it's music. I have become completely obsessed with the slaves. <laughs> um, I will put a link in that blog post of my favorites <laughs> so you can listen to them. I love them. They're so good and I heard that they're really good at performing which makes me so excited because that means that like oh, I'm so excited. Anyway if you haven't heard of the slaves check them out. I'm pretty sure I put like all the songs I've ever listened to them of them in my like top five songs of the week but it, like seriously just go check them out. Okay. That was all. I hope you enjoyed my May favorites. If you have any of the products or you know a better product or something that I might enjoy or an app or anything, let me know down below. Once again, all the socials are down below and anything I talked about in the video is all in that lovely box. So go check it out. I will see you guys next Monday with a new vlog. And don't forget that if you wanted to buy or check out anything, I will put my blog post of my monthly favorites down below so you can go to that and then click the links on that and go shopping. Go crazy. Have fun. Here are the top five songs of the week and here are the top five ways to get through that last month of the school year. You're so close to being done. I believe in you. You can do it and then you can enjoy your summer. 
So just finish strong, okay? And I will see you guys next week. Bye. Bye.